I can't tell you what it makes me feel like when I hear Stel singing that last line. Hi hey everyone, welcome back to my channel, whoever here. I hope that you are all doing well. I'm almost at the end of my catch-up spree and I had to leave the five to last. So this is SB19 performing MAPA at the Round Festival 2023. I can't believe that they're drip feeding us. I for sure thought they were just going to give us the whole lot of performances, but okay. Um, I'm just being greedy as always. I'm looking forward to this. Do you remember how they sounded? How they looked? The reception that they got? It was a killer set. And I'm really, really looking forward to, on this occasion, seeing them in these outfits because they looked so stunning. It was custom made, they were all shining, and I'm really looking forward to this. And it happens to be Mapa as well. Oh cool, look at the R! I do really, really love Justin's fit, you know. Wow. Have they edited this? There's a slight delay between his mouth moving and the track. That's quite annoying. That's really weird. I hope it's not my internet. That doesn't even look like it's coming out of his mouth. I don't know what is going on. Did they make a mistake recording this? Because when you hear Josh talking, it sounds live. It sounds very much like in the back, like an echo. But when they're singing, it sounds really, really weird. Sounding amazing, of course. As always, it sounds like the official track, which I'm quite used to. And by this point in the performance, they had all been like sweated off. The makeup is gone. Um, Estelle looks amazing. Look at these shoulders. I'm not even kidding now. I think Josh sung it differently to this on the actual night. Something has happened here, and I'm sorry to be really, really annoying to constantly point out the bleeding obvious, but I think they've just put the official track on top of the recording for some reason. Like, I think they must have messed up the recording, but it's really, really distracting. It's such a shame. I have watched those fan cams so many times that I'm so familiar with it, and it's not quite this. They look so handsome. See?
Pablo's got such a wonderful style to him. So if Josh has this stage presence, Pablo also has his own thing going on. The way that he holds his hands and the way that he'll like uh, hold his chest, he does his own like little mannerisms. It's very, very Pablo. <laughs> Yeah. Oh. oh, that's live. Do you hear the difference between the recording and before the between the official track and the real life recording? There's a big difference in the quality of that voice. And it's a real shame because I think that actually on that particular night, they were feeling very strong. They were out there to show off and their harmonies were as on point as always. And they were really, really audible, even from the fan cam. OK, and I'm really missing it. I feel like a part of the magic of this performance has been lost in this post-production such a shame not on our boys whatsoever because i know that they could deliver this in their sleep um and they've given us countless performances of marpa that have been top notch and they will continue to do so it's just such a shame that they've been invited to an event and something has obviously been just captured incorrectly that has meant that they'd have to do this and actually for um, if i was coming into this fresh if i wasn't there in real life i would think that they were miming which is not what they're doing whatsoever <laughs> Now this is live. And listen to those harmonies. I can't tell you what it makes me feel like when I hear Stell singing that last line. I just love it so much and oh, I love it, but it was such a shame that whatever happened happened, but I'm going to let it go because I'm hoping that that has not happened to all of the performances or at least perhaps 18 have commented that below this video and that the feedback will reach uh, the Round Festival and that whenever they start to produce the rest of the performances, they won't do what they did here. Um, I'd really love them to release the raw track, even if it ends up being kind of like fan cam footage type. That is absolutely fine. We need to hear the live vocals. That's a huge part of that is what SB19 is all about. Those live vocals those live harmonies and don't try and cover it up or mask it but yeah they look amazing on this night i'm getting to see the fit so well as well i think out of all of the looks i love how justin looks he looks amazing like this i think josh's fit on him as well because i forget actually how slim josh is he's muscly and he's toned but he's actually really slim and the way that it cinches into that teeny tiny waist is amazing now pablo's inner shirt was sheer and i forget that too he looked amazing i feel like ken and stell power dressing for the both of them is amazing because they've got builds in very very different ways but they they always pull this sort of look off amazingly like i feel like they dress ken in this like superman kind of gear and he always looks so good like super hero and he always pulls it off anyway and black for ken is amazing for stell yeah those big broad shoulders and i can't remember whether he actually ever like takes the jacket like not off but it, it parts at all and what the shirt's like in it but from the photo shoot and um everything that they did all those photos he looked stunning and i actually really like it the makeup by this point has melted off and you can see that natural beauty underneath as well really really stunning do you talk to me about this performance? What did you think? Did you notice the change in the recording and then in the live bit at the very end? I can't wait for the rest of the tracks to drop. Thank you so much for watching this with me. I hope that you had fun.
And until I see you next time, take care. Stay safe. Bye.